This is a Redstone Block 2 train and missile field operation conducted by Battery A, 2nd Missile Battalion, 333rd Artillery, 46th Artillery Group at Neckarsohn, Germany in October 1960. In the following scenes, members of Battery A's servicing section are seen removing the cover off of the Warhead transport trailer. This is the missile warhead unit resting on its transport trailer. Servicing section personnel are now removing the cover from the aft unit transport trailer. The aft unit housed the instrument compartment containing the inertial guidance system. Servicing section personnel will now remove the thrust unit transport trailer cover. And here we see the thrust unit resting on its transport trailer. Firing section personnel will now unroll and hook up power and signal cable assemblies.
We next see the 60 kVA diesel generator and the power distribution trailer. The servicing section will now mate the warhead unit with the aft unit to create the missile body. The mating of these two units is facilitated by the use of the battery's 5-ton wrecker truck. This time-saving procedure was developed and initiated by 40th Artillery Group shortly after its arrival in Germany in the summer of 1958. Prior to this, the two units were mated using the lightweight A-frame rigging. The wrecker truck was usually driven and operated by a member of the battery's motor pool contingent. Nominally, three members of the firing battery's headquarters section were assigned to the motor pool for overall vehicle maintenance and upkeep. We next see the special spreader bar and unique lifting bridle used to hoist the aft unit off of its transport trailer. We are looking into the skirt section of the aft unit at the lower pressure bulkhead of the instrument compartment. In this view of the skirt section of the aft unit, we can see the two high pressure air spheres and the four motor actuators for the air vanes.